welcome to my tutorial series Let's make a Lego movie together. In this series you can follow my process of creating a Lego short film in Blender. The tutorials are meant to be short and informative. You should be familiar with the basics of Blender. If there are still questions, don't hesitate to write them in the comments below. We can all learn from each other. This video is about creating a Lego character. First, we have to import a minifigure into Blender. There are several ways to do this. One way is to export a file from Megabricks. Go to workshop on megabricks.com. Set up your character. Export your file in Blender add-on format. Make sure that you are logged in when exporting. Open Blender. The Megabricks Blender add-on must be installed. You can find it on the Megabricks website. Then go to File, Import, Megabricks. The big advantage of the Megabricks import is that the models come with protections. Now you could rig your character. But before rigging your character you should be clear about how your animation should look like. A stop motion style like in the Lego movie or a 3D animation style like in the Ninjago television series. I used the 3D organic look. Now I show you how I set up my minifigure. I work with the Eldro library. You have to download and install it. The Blender Eldro importer as well. Now you can work with the old Lego Digital Designer or the Brickling Studio 2.0. I recommend Studio 2.0 because you still get the latest updates. Create your minifigure. Then you go to File, Export as LDRAW. Now we are back in Blender. Make sure that you install the LDRAW add-on. Go to File, Import, L draw. The correct path should be set. Import your minifigure. First we delete the empty and resize the minifigure to normal human size. I scaled it 0.4 times. The focal length of the camera should fit better now. At the moment the minifigure looks very edgy. That's why we smooth our character now. Delete the edge split modifier and add a subdivision surface modifier. To get rid of a few unwanted geometries, I made a few changes until I had my basic minifigure. That's it for the first tutorial. In the next one I show you how I make my textures and set up my materials for the character. If you know better, let me know in the comments. I'm still learning.